So last night, I was just scrolling through LinkedIn, and I swear, every single person on this planet is now a web developer. If you throw a stone at a crowd, it will probably hit a web developer. Honestly, it's everywhere. Even your grandma probably knows how to make a website by now. So, why is literally everyone obsessed with web development? You know, there was a time when knowing how to make a website would get you all the girls. But now even a 10-year-old is flexing their HTML knowledge. Part of it makes sense because web dev is super accessible. You don't need a fancy degree or be super smart. Just you and a tutorial on YouTube. But the thing is, just because everyone's doing it doesn't mean it's all sunshine and unicorns. Let's talk about this weird obsession of people with web development. First reason is, of course, because of its accessibility and low barrier to entry. You just need a laptop, Wi-Fi, VS Code, and a live server extension installed. You're good to go. Next, complete a seven-hour tutorial, build a to-do list, and congratulations. You are officially a web developer now. I'm not exaggerating this. This is the all you need to follow to become the member of the tribe. Next reason is the money and career potential. Let's be honest, web developers can make good money, even when they're just starting out. The demand for web developers is good, and so is supply. Companies everywhere need websites, so demand is always out there. They have the option of freelancing, jobs, so people see web dev as a gate to enter into tech. Everyone loves the idea of learn a few things online and get paid. And let's be honest, it sounds way cooler than explaining to your parents that you spent six months learning about AI. But because of the competition in AI, the money and career potential part is slowly fading. Next one is misconceptions and hype. People think web dev is easy. Just drag a button here, change some colors, and you'll be paid dollars every month. See, the thing is everyone knows the basics of web development, but there are only a few who are actually good at it. There are lots of jobs, but there's also plenty of competition. Besides, the easier stuff is already beginning to be automated or done with tools that don't require any knowledge at all. Lastly, instant result. Web dev fits perfectly with today's instant gratification culture. You type some code, hit refresh, and something visible changes immediately. Compare that to jobs like DevOps or cybersecurity. In web dev, you can see your progress immediately, and that's an influencing factor for most people. So we discussed about why everyone is obsessed with web development, but now let's talk about the reality. You see, what most people don't realize is that web development can be a bit of chaos. Like, sure, it's fun when you're typing HTML syntax and watching box changing colors. But when you start learning deeper stuff, it gets tough. It's all rainbow and sunshine when you're learning the basics, but later you will have to deal with designing scalable systems, understanding architecture patterns, handling concurrency, or optimizing database queries, and other 99 things. That's why most people only know the basics. And then there's the competition. Remember how everyone's learning web dev? Yeah, now you're competing with all of them. You'll compete with other 100 applicants who has the same projects on their resume. Next thing is, web technologies moves faster than TikTok trends. One day it's React, next day it's Next.js, and before you even finish your course, there is this new JavaScript framework watching you from afar. A lot of people get into web dev expecting instant success, but the truth is, getting good takes time. You don't just watch five tutorials and become a senior engineer. It's a long grind of learning, failing, fixing, and occasionally crying over why your layout works perfectly in Chrome, but breaks in Safari for no reason whatsoever. So yeah, web dev is awesome. It's creative, rewarding, and full of opportunity. But it's not the easy, learn quick, get rich skim. It's messy, it's frustrating, but if you stick with it and become good at it, it's actually one of the most satisfying things you can learn. So here's the thing, web dev isn't bad. In fact, it's one of the most useful skills you can have. But it's not the only thing out there. Some people treat web dev like it's the entire universe of programming. There's data science, mobile app development, game dev, cybersecurity, AI, the list goes on. So a lot of people start with web dev because it's the easiest to access. And honestly, that's fine. It's a great starting point. You learn coding logic, problem solving, how to actually make something people can use. But the key is to realize that web dev isn't the end game. 
you can easily switch to other fields of tech if you want. There's more to explore. And once you get comfortable, you might discover you love backend more, or mobile apps, or AI, or cloud engineering. There's a whole other things out there to try. So yeah, everyone's obsessed with web dev, and honestly, I get it. It's accessible, it's creative, it pays well, and it's one of the easiest ways to feel like you're actually building something. But just remember, the internet makes it look like everyone's out here living their dream life, when in reality, half of them are unemployed. What matters is finding something you actually enjoy enough to stick with. Anyway, I'm curious, why did you start learning web dev? Was it the money, the hype, or pure curiosity? Drop it in the comments. I want to see the real reasons. And if you like this video, maybe hit the like button and subscribe the channel for similar content. I'll see you guys in the next one.